Can you hear that, beavers? <laughs> We're getting it flowing. <laughs> hey, hey, what's up, you guys? So it is two days after the tropical storm that dumped the 10 inches of rain in such a short amount of time. And I want to go, we're heading back here to the crossing, my ATV crossing. I want to see, I'm pretty sure them boards got washed away again. I want to see how far they got this time. That's the first thing I'm going to check on. Then of course I'll show you guys Beaver Dam Creek at the road beside my house here. And uh, I also want to check on the beaver dam that we tore out by the pond for Brother Larry. See how that's looking. And here's the thing. I know that y'all haven't seen the work that I've done at the beaver chair dam area yet, but <laughs> I'm going to go and check that out as well. So that's kind of sort of going to put things out of order. But that's why it's important that you watch every video so that you know what's going on. All right. Wow. All of this. Yeah. Dang. All of this was underwater and the mosquitoes have been resurrected. Y'all remember the video? I don't know if I put it on YouTube or not, but I put a video up on my social media where they came through spraying for mosquitoes. Uh, and after Debbie, after Debbie, they was ridiculous. But they they had sort of died down, but I think this rain is gonna bring them back. So this is this is where I cross that with the with the four wheeler. People be talking about just drive across it. No, that thing that thing is deep. You can't get across there with a um, a regular sport quad. Now if I had a four by four, that would be nothing. <laughs> Definitely, boards got washed way away this time. So it seems to be. I don't see them and. I don't know how clear it is over here. Oh, I think I see one. I see one of them. Oh, I see two of them. Okay. <laughs> oh man. I know they can't go but so far because they got weight. They got some good weight to them. I'm gonna have to put the potato rake down and drag this joker. Ugh. I tell you, it's always some work for us, ain't it? Ugh. Uh, huh, telling you these these jokers uh, got some good weight to them. Uh, 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 I'm gonna go ahead and put them across here while I got on my chest waders so I can step down in the creek and place it where it needs to be. Uh, I can see right there is where it was. Right there. Okay, so that's one. <laughs> oh yeah, Jesus, he's like a bridge over troubled water. <laughs> yeah, I know I'm always thinking of something spiritual. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go get the other one. Oh, now this one over here is a little more trivial. Ah. There's a watermelon over there. Where did that come? Oh, wow. So my brother's garden probably got flooded and, <laughs> and <laughs> washed a watermelon way over here. That's crazy. That's crazy. It's a good thing I'm getting these things now because I can imagine the mosquitoes will get only, only get worse from here on. From here on out. Uh, wow, this is a workout. Uh, 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 boy. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Uh, 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 okay. All right. Maybe that's right. I'm gonna let it do anyway. 
All right, you guys, I will check back in when we get uh, closer to the road. Okay, so some of y'all probably wondering what that is. That's the old pump house. That's how we used to get water, but we got, uh, we got county water. So <laughs> that's the old pump house that you seen underwater. Well, it wasn't completely underwater, but it was flowing uh, through it. Because <laughs> it's got a hole. But uh, yeah, I guess this is, this is how it looks without water being here in the yard. Whew, and it's hot. It's hot today, but that's good. I'm glad that it's hot and that the sun is out because that'll help dry up the water. But, yep. Water's down. But uh, closer to the coast of North Carolina, like closer to the beaches, they're still having a lot of flooding. And uh, a lot of the roads seem like that way have washed out. This is how it's looking two days after. Got all the debris there up on the bank. But it's down a good bit, you guys. I'm not gonna stay here long. I am gonna go across the road here though. I hear water crashing back there by the dinosaur foot tree. We are gonna go and take a peep at it. <sighs> I guess I better be watching out for snakes too because this definitely wakes up the snakes. I'll tell you that water be crashing so loud back here I'll be thinking it's a dam. Let me put up my spider guard. I don't walk in one without y'all. <laughs> Let's see here. It looked look like a beach around here, don't it? All the sand. I mean, it did a crazy kind of flushing out this time, man. It came so quick. All right, come on out of there. All right, you guys, so this is how I was looking here at this part of Beaver Dam Creek. Oh! <laughs> so we gonna, we gonna keep it moving, all right? All right, you guys, so we're at the Beaver Chair Dam area. I actually skipped the, the new spot by the pond because one of the brothers might be hunting back there. So anyway, we're here. Look at all of the dirt that washed out of the field. That is crazy. So we're gonna see how it's looking here. I know the water blew out the big dam. I didn't never make it to the big dam the other day. I was way downstream. I don't know if y'all remember from season one, how we went way downstream. That's the only area I was able to work at when it got dark on me. And I'm gonna tell you what, I did find somebody that can work on ACs. So I got my air conditioner fixed on the Tahoe. It came to a thousand dollars. Whew, boy, that hurt my pockets. But when I was just in the truck, Lord have mercy, I was giving God praise for my AC cause it was hot. <laughs> Thank God that it is working again. So I needed a compressor. I needed the whole nine yards, the compressor, the condenser, all of that stuff that comes with it. I had to get all of that new. <clears throat> Some switches and everything. But I'm grateful that I was able to uh, be able to, to pay for it. Let me lock this, uh, close this tight so that it don't drop my phone out. Who that is? Sound like a diesel truck. 
I love the sound of a diesel. <laughs> you might got a tune on that one, the way it was sounding. Oh, I just walked. <laughs> okay, let me pay attention. Let me pay attention to my surroundings and not the truck. I just walked into a whole spider web. Oh, did it get on y'all too? <clears throat> mm. I mean, I felt the whole web in my mouth and everything. <clears throat> <laughs> Raccoon been out here. Now I gotta try to remember to talk to y'all like y'all haven't seen. <laughs> uh, what we did the other day. It's flowing, that's for sure. You can tell, wow, how it Flushed all over here. Wow. Wow. Oh man. I had left my shovel here. Thank God that it didn't, that stick is holding it. Man, it could have been gone. The pickaxe too. Wow. 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 I think it, uh, it moved some of the burn pile, you guys. The burn pile has been moved. And the dam is definitely blown out. Let me, uh, let me take off my backpack. I'm gonna go ahead and walk across there. Now this might be sort of sketchy trying to get over there because it may have gotten sort of deep. We really, really, really gotta burn that pile. You guys, last year, or was it earlier this year? I can't even remember now. Um, I brought some fire logs starter thingies. So that ought to help us out with our uh, kindling of the fire. <laughs> yeah, I know we always struggled. Always struggled to get it started. And there's, wow, okay. I guess there's, there's more of the dam here right here in this particular area left then you can see but over there in the middle i gotta be careful man i gotta be careful because i can imagine this has some pressure to it i don't like this i don't like this one bit i don't like this one bit you guys not one. Oh yeah oh yeah Oh yeah, wow, wow. I'm not going across there. No ma'am and no sir. <laughs> this is the furthest I'm going. <laughs> um, yeah, see? This is how you know beaver dams are not supposed to be here. The water did the work for us. This is not supposed to be a, a, a actual Beaver Dam removal anyway. We're just supposed to be checking in, right? Uh, but y'all know how we do. Y'all know how we do. We gotta scratch a little bit. We gotta scratch a little bit. Make the beavers all the more upset. That's a big piece right there that I... Can't really fool with that joker. Mm. Something is, something has got it. Something, I think that right there. And now I'm splashing beaver water everywhere. See if we can get it now. There we go. I'm about to, I'm about to go ahead and get on out of here. Oh shoot. Mm. Yep, that's enough. Mm. It's hard. 
it's hard to pull it when you ain't really taking it apart properly. They do a good work intertwining it. So uh, I'm debating on if I want to go downstream or not. I'll think about it. All right, we're going to get out of here. I'm not going to go downstream so that I'm not... What's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> I don't know. It would, you know, sort of make things worse, worse out of order. So as I leave here, I'm going to check and see if uh, it still has some activity by the pond, the new spot. And if it looks like somebody's still over there, I'm just going to go ahead to Gator Creek. I want to go to Gator Creek to the one dam that's on the other side of the culvert, the one that we always tear out, the one that always has a snake at it and see how it looks there. All right, so I will check back in once we get to the next spot, you guys. All righty, so we are at the new spot here at the pond. It is four days later. I want to walk over here and look over here and see. Oh, that water's nice and milky, but you can definitely tell. Well, I guess that's where the, wow, that's where the water was on the leaves from the flooding. But even right now, it sort of looks lower than it was um, before we tore the dam out. I mean, after we tore the dam out. But let's go in and see. Uh, how it's looking you guys oh spider web oh yeah good flow good flow I don't see any rebuild I do see something swimming swimming around though Yeah, that definitely helped flush it on out. The work that we did helped. Oh, oh. <laughs> that thing drops, man. It drops. It drops, it drops, it drops. Break up some of that mud. Yes. I hear some water crashing somewhere. I did sort of need to try to figure out where we are with Beaver Dam Creek. Oh, look at, oh, wait a minute. Look at this. Wait a minute. So wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Okay, so if this, this right here, wait a minute, okay. So this is Beaver Dam Creek right here. It's gotta be. But where am I? Is that a field? Is that a soybean field over there? I can't tell. Now is the time to go ahead and explore. Now is the time to go ahead and explore. This is different. Where am I? <laughs> I do not recognize. Okay. Okay. Man, I can't get across there, that's for sure. If I can get across, because I see an opening. This might be, okay, I think I know where I am now. I think, I think. But this is definitely Beaver Dam Creek right here. This is interesting. Ooh, I heard you. Oh gosh. Oh, I'm holding on to this tree and it's falling because the beetle, the beavers girdled it. Look at that. It's just as rotten as can be. And I was about to fall in the creek. Yeah, I can't get across there, but I think, I think we got a soybean field. 
right over there, you guys. Okay. I'm learning, I'm learning the geography. I can't quite tell what part of the soybean field it is, but it's where I be riding. Y'all know I be riding the four wheeler around the soybean field. It's somewhere over there. Wow, okay, I never knew that. Okay, so anyway, enough talking. Um, I'm a, I am gonna go ahead and head to Gated Creek right quick before it gets dark, okay? So I will check back in when we get to Gator Creek. Alrighty, you guys, we are at Gator Creek. Gator Creek. I was gonna park over here, cause I'm not gonna be here long, but there's a lot of sinkholes over here. There's a lot of places that's uh, washing out with sinkholes, but, uh, ooh, it needs to be mowed too. Let's look over the culvert here. I see water flowing out over that way. And so, man, <laughs> it's almost like I need to start this as the new season, but I'm not. Cause it's been a minute since we've done any work here as well. And I don't even have my backpack on me because I, I am not about to be trying to make a whole episode of this. But as we look at the culvert there where it's at on the culvert, it's still rather high. The beavers have been pulling sticks up here, it looks like. Trees. Y'all see this? This right here, I feel like this whole thing is, might be hollow up under there. I wonder if they've been burrowing up under there. Here we are, wow. Looks like a beach out here as well, doesn't it? Look at all the sand. The water has Oh my goodness, look at this. Now see, it, oh my goodness, it, it got it good. It got it good. Um, wow. <laughs> the water, it had, it had to find an escape route and that's the way it went because of this dam. Man, this is a mess. Oh, this is a mess. Look at these great big boulders of dirt. Look at all the daggone sand that's washed over. What in the world? Man, this is gonna be sort of hard to tell whenever we do get here. They've had that established too long for sure. Trail camera, the trail camera's still there. You know, I should go ahead and get the, take it with me. I really should. It looked like it, uh, ooh. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Did it get underwater? Oh, no, you guys. Oh, no. oh, what? Get out of town. You saw that? It's still working. Get out of town. Get out of town, you guys. I saw the red infrared thingy like, get out of town. The batteries are still working. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely about to take it with me now. That is crazy. That is crazy, you guys. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and snatch that up. Look at this here, though. It's sort of built back up with sand, man. That's, man. The flood might have helped them a little bit here. They, oh my goodness. Y'all remember we had this thing dug out good and it still is sort of dug out good. Man. Now y'all do know. I mean, y'all do know, right? I mean, this is 
crazy. All this dirt here, man. I am, I don't like that one bit. I don't like that one bit. I don't like that one bit. We got to create us at least a narrow channel. At least a little narrow channel that can sort of help start flushing some of the, the dirt out. Because I know that they're gonna rebuild here. I know that they are. They all they always rebuild. I should be throwing this stuff over. On the banks. I really should. But I don't have time right now. We're gonna do it like this. Maybe I can throw a little bit. I threw that in the water. <laughs> I threw that in the water. We need a, a good breach. It's been breached, but not good like this. Or better, I'll say. Oh my goodness! What? What? Don't tell me the beavers put that in there. <laughs> We're getting it flowing. <laughs> I had to. I had to say it, you guys. I had to. All right, pulling down ain't helping me. I need to pull to the side. I know what hit him. Beavers ain't gonna know what hit him, you guys. Terrell back? Team Terrell must be back. We're in trouble. That's right. That's right. Team Terrell is back. <laughs> All right. Like I said, man, this ain't no episode. So, we've done enough. That'll, that'll keep them a little bit busy. That'll keep them a little bit busy. Maybe help flush out some of that sand back there. How many times I'm gonna say it, right? Y'all know I'm repetitive. Too repetitive. But that's okay. It makes me who I am. <laughs> that's crazy though. As a matter of fact, let me see. Let me see. If I got enough, oh no, I don't got enough horsepower. 
But I tell you what, I can do this. I can do this. I got enough strength to do this. Good gracious, man. I know they couldn't have put that there. That had to have been over there on the side and fell in or something, man. <laughs> or washed down. Probably washed down from there. I'm still working, right? I can't help it. I can't help it, you guys. All right, that's enough for real. All right, let's uh, let's snatch up this trail camera. Let me see. I guess I might as well take the whole thing. Mm. Mm. Oh, you what a walking spider! Get off of there! I just take it off like this. Y'all see the lights on it? That's crazy. Dude, this thing been out here for oh, for about six months now. <laughs> and it's still working. That is crazy. That is crazy. This is one of the ones we got from uh, Brother Ron. God bless his soul. He's resting with Jesus now. Steven Beaver, your trail camera, I just pray to God. Oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> it's at Beaver Dam Swamp. So, oh my goodness, man. I just pray to God it's still there. Oh, I can only imagine how things are looking back there. Oh my goodness. That is insane, you guys. Oh, uh, memory full. I bet it is. I bet it is. 200 and 66 wow 12 27 2023 wow that is crazy anyway um yeah we're gonna go ahead and get on out of here you guys I don't want to ruin it. <laughs> All righty, we about to wrap this on up. Man, you guys, we got another 1,000 subscribers in two days on YouTube. So welcome all of you new subscribers, man. The shorts are reeling them in. <laughs> um, I want to give a big, big, big shout out to Sister Deb Cat. Sister Deb Cat, you are just a huge blessing financially, man. Um, even brother Mark is yet grateful for how you helped him out during his time of uh, financial need and his health issues, man. So we definitely want to continue to keep brother Mark in prayer um, and brother Mark Beaver as well. We want to keep him in prayer as well. Brother Mark Beaver and brother Mark McCulloch. Um, yeah. So. I just thought about, you know, how, you know, the Lord, he provides, as his scripture says, he supplies all of our needs according to his riches and glory, which is in Christ Jesus. And he works through people. He works through people when they give, you know, financially. So I'm just grateful forever, grateful for all of you guys, you know, who have given throughout the years. Man, you guys have been a blessing, man. I appreciate you all. And yeah, stay tuned. There's more to come. <laughs> like I said, we, we did some work at the Beaver Chair Dam area, so I got to get that uh, out to you guys. And I guess we'll be starting a new season here in Gator Creek soon. So, uh, yeah. Stay tuned. Oh, and with the shorts. <laughs> I got to get some more of them edited too. I got the people hooked on the, the culvert clearing. <laughs> but anyway, man, I hope that you guys have enjoyed watching. Smash that like button for us. Throw a comment in the comment section. Let me know what's on your mind. Jesus Christ is Lord. To the glory of God the Father. You guys stay blessed. You guys keep encouraged. And as always, we'll see you in the next one.